that shows the projected movement of passive particles at different depths emanating from the wellhead. And you can see here that there is kind of a, a northeast-southwest movement of the particles modeled by Dr. Weisberg of the USF College of Marine Science. This top figure shows the movement if the particles were released at 400 meters, and the bottom figure shows release at 1,000 meters. And in both cases, you can see that the oil is projected to follow the, the depth contours. They're a little bit hard to see in, with this lighting, but the depth contours run in this area, and the oil particles follow those depth contours. So when it came time for us to design the cruise, we uh, were very con concerned about these depth contours, especially in this case, we picked the 400 and 1,000 meter contours. So we have a series of, of locations that we sample that we refer to as stations. And each of these involve the collection of water samples from repeated different depths. 